ورسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم يقول كل بدعة ضلالة If, if tiredness overtakes you in these last 10 nights, take a coffee. It's a good stimulant. All right, no sugar, just strong black coffee, a short. Turkish is the best. My brother Ozan will tell you how to make one, inshallah. Uh, no problem with a date. And you're back up and running, inshallah. All right, so take a coffee and spend your night. How many hours is it? It's going, it's going to be Fajr soon. It's midnight now, so what, 4.30? You can catch the last third of the night as well. Aisha radiallahu anha said that the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wasallam did not exceed upon 11 raka'ahs for the night prayer. In the month of Ramadan, no outside the month of Ramadan. So what is better is that you do not add to the night prayer. That is what is better, as Shaykh al-Albani and others have mentioned. Likewise, Ibn Uthaymeen. We have prayed 11. You don't need to add any more to that. So what do you do for the rest of the night? For the rest of the night, read the Quran. Make dua. Ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to forgive you. Ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to have mercy upon your parents. Rabbi ghfirli wali walidayya. My Lord, forgive me and forgive my parents. Make dua for them. Make dua for your children. Make dua for yourselves. That Allah rectifies you and makes you good parents. Because many of us are not good parents. We think we are because we think it's all about certificates and making them rich. It is not about that, Barakallahu Feekum. Richness is richness of the soul. That is what, what richness is. Ghina, the true ghina, the true richness is the richness of the soul. It's not kathratul arad. It is not the gathering of much possessions. If Allah gives you, Allah gives you. And give back in the cause of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has given men riches. That is not blameworthy so long as they spend it in the cause of Allah. But the true richness is not what they have gathered. It's not these cars or these houses or these garments or this jewelry. True richness is what lies beneath the chest. Between... Underneath that rib cage, that is true richness. That is the richness of the soul and the expanse of the heart. That is true richness, barakallahu feekum. So ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in these nights.